test. It's been a while. I haven't posted a true vlog on here in a while and I've just been kind of MIA so if there are people here who have been looking forward to that then like my apologies <laughs> but just thought I'd cut to today so we could connect and say what's up and show you kind of like the highlights of my day today whatever those may be and as you can see by the background things have changed I'm no longer at Babcha's and I also have gotten the opportunity to move around Poland a little bit more so right now I'm in Jeshul, the capital of the Podkarpacki region in Poland, which is super beautiful. And I'm really happy to be here. I also just wanted to confirm that I'm still in Poland. I don't know for how long as usual, but I'm still here, which is exciting because I'm loving it and I'm enjoying it more now than I think I was before, especially because like when I arrived, COVID was really heavy and being said, there's still a war going on next door. So those vibes have been still in like quite the homebody, but I definitely like I'm trying to see more. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm currently filming in a new apartment. I figured today maybe I could just show you guys what I'm doing on a daily if you're interested and we can go into town. It's a very different vibe here than in Warsaw because Zeshov is much smaller. And I also appreciate that because it's something that I'm not used to and I'm like trying to experience new things, you know, see what's for me. I've been living in like only big cities for as long as I can remember. So this is something a little bit different. People don't speak as much English here, I've noticed. Air is fresher. <laughs> We're closer to mountains and I wish I had a car, I really do, um, but I still don't have a car in Poland. I have a bike now. Bought a bike today. Love it. I bought my bike from someone on Facebook Marketplace, but I also heard that OLX, OLX is also a good place for used goods and I'm so grateful to have this bike to get around. Inaczej od Warszawy w Rzeszowie zauważyłam, że ludzie szybko złapią czy zidentyfikują osoby, które są z zewnątrz. Też jest taka możliwość, że Polacy są bardziej przyjaźni tu niż w Warszawie. I ten rowerzysta też był bardzo miły, żeby mi pokazać poprawną trasę. Pogupale też jest bardzo fajny. On jest jeszcze nie zagospodarowany do końca. Tam się coś dzieje. This is a spiegelage for my granary. Let's see the country. Tough stock. What the heck is this? Przystanek na zielenie. Babcha told me to be very careful buying bikes in Poland because apparently a lot of them are stolen and you just like should really take down the name, the address, whoever you're buying the bike from. If they have a receipt like from purchasing it themselves in a store, that's even better. Anyway, it's a really cute bike. Original price was probably like $300 and I think I paid $200 because she claims to have not used it much. I'm about to go down a really big hill so I'm gonna end this here, but I've got a bike, I'm happy. That's exciting. <clears throat> but yeah, you know, it's nice to get comments and emails, things like insight into Poland and what to see here. So I really do appreciate that. Yeah, first things first, pierwsza rzecz pierwsza. We have to make some breakfast, kitchen's that way. and. I haven't gotten up, up out of bed yet, so we need to fix the bed situation and get a move on the day. Buzaki. I 
invited Bobcha. She's never been to Jeshul, but she made it very clear she's never stepping foot in this apartment because she has a serious fear of heights and elevators. She's seen pictures though. Now we'll just we'll just set a timer for like five six minutes, and I'm gonna toss some yogurt on this, and we're gonna call that a breakfast. <laughs> hours. <laughs> we'll be back. I had to go pick it up at one of those package points. This is great news that this has arrived. I ordered a case for my laptop, just something to like protect it a little bit. I recently bought a new laptop and I decided to like look up some Polish brands to find something suitable and not too expensive. The leaves are definitely falling. I'm sad I couldn't show you just on a sunnier day, but those are kind of rare now that we've entered into fall. Oh, this is as pretty as it's gonna get. Many days I don't have to report on site for work so I try and get out of the house and sit in cafes. I've also felt quite lonely lately and weird for coming to these coffee shops to work alone. You know, in bigger cities with more of a hustle culture, it's typical to look over and see everyone on their headphones plugged into something else, but here it seems like the norm is definitely more about socializing in cafes with friends and family than remote work, which is good, it's just too bad for me. Also reminded me that I miss having more girlies to drink coffee with, but I guess that's also part of the struggle with moving often. This is what we've got to look forward to in the next couple of months. It's gonna be gray, it's gonna be cold, it's gonna be wet. Great!
We have to go back home to change because the weather got worse. So this is one of those things that I can like about Jacques. Everything I need is in walking distance or like it wouldn't take that long to walk the entirety of the town. So maybe I don't need a car. Plus they have buses and whatnot, but I'd rather just I decided to get lunch at this place called Under Seoul. They serve Korean food, which is pretty exotic for Zhezhov, maybe unsurprising, but most of the restaurants here serve traditional European food. And then there are lots and lots of kebab spots. So I've been really looking forward to trying something different. I definitely noticed a very hip young crowd while I was there, but also the city has a few universities, so there's a lot of young people around in general. By a change of plans, a friend reached out and I'm gonna go get coffee even though it's seven o'clock at night. This time the coffee was served in this pretty Polish pottery called Bolesławiec. fresh but wrinkled sheets on them and yesterday i stopped filming this sort of happens after a while you just give up right but i hope you enjoyed the day that we had together i hope that you guys are all well and we will have some more videos showing up in the future as usual i don't really know